Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna talk about what should we do if we want to manifest something or somebody so quickly. But before we start, I'm TG. I'm here to tell you about my success stories, tips and techniques that I'm using this manifestation period. And if you want the magic in your life, please subscribe my channel and turn on notifications so you're not missing anything. And let's jump to the topic so quickly. What should we do if we want to manifest something or somebody very quickly? And what is the mental state that we have to on okay so the first one is the first rule you should always know that the rule everybody is you pushed out okay even if you're sp even if you're even if your boss even if your mother even if your relatives whatever even if your friends or even if you somebody else that you want to uh you that you want to attract into your life or you want them to uh, make what you want you have to accept that everyone is you pushed out okay there is no free will outside of you and everything is just happening according uh, to your assumptions and to your beliefs okay if you have an, a bad assumption about somebody do not expect them to do good things okay so please just expect them uh they do what you want okay for example if you want to uh, raise your earning or your salary just try to make an assumption that your boss just decide that uh, making a raise for uh in your income okay so uh, if you want to manifest your sp specific person the one you love and you want you expect them to do uh something that you really like you should uh, assume that they already done it okay so uh, this is i think the main point that mm, giving no free will to anybody in your life okay or anything in your life because everything happens inside of you if you feel something inside it means that it has to be turned into heart and it's just turned into a fact okay so please do never forget that everyone is your push out so please do not give anybody or anything free will in your reality okay the second one it's the identity or states that you are in right now okay so you have to learn how to change it if you are just assume that you want to be a, you want to be in a relationship you have to be Become that person okay if you're not if you're just feeling lack about that relationship and if you just want it you crave about the relationship it means that you don't have relationship right now and if you don't have it right now it means it's a, it's lack right so you should feel like that you are in a relationship and you are that person who has a relationship with the person that you want or with the, with an, with a person that you really desire okay so you have to acknowledge that um, the states you are in right now attracts the things okay if you are in a relationship right now the states okay if you feel like that you attract relationship but if you're just uh, feel yourself like as a single and it means that you're staying single okay because this is who you are right now okay and just make a positive assumption about yourself okay you are lovable you're chosen okay everyone can feel good stuff about you okay no one just uh wants to miss you okay so that's why uh the states and um the states are really important okay so the third one it's use your um sleep in a very well uh <laughs> very well feelings okay you have to yeah you know that states i can to sleep okay when you go to sleep just a few seconds just dream about that what you want to have in your li life okay just imagine that you're already in that situation and you're so happy about that and leave that feeling before you fall asleep okay so or in your meditative state it's the same uh it's the same thing so when you meditate just feel yourself for like a five minutes or ten minutes that you are living the life that you desire okay if you want to have a relationship just feel that you have a relationship with that person right now if you want money just feel that you are rich right now or wealthy your life if you want to make a perfect career just feel like that you are in a in that perfect career and use that mediative states or the time that before you go to sleep 
and use efficiently okay if you are using this efficiently you will see quick results okay the next one is of course revision okay if you're if something happened in the past and you uh, it affects you very badly just revise the events okay and also not just the past events you can revise your day every night okay just revise it um like for example you want to manifest your sp and you want to be in a relationship with him at night just revise the day like you spent whole day with your sp and you just went to the cinema that day or you did a lot of things together you shared the same uh couch together you watch tv whatever okay just revise your day like that then revising is very efficient uh process because when you revise the events that your subconscious just understand that okay this is what happened today so i should serve that way and there is no effect on us the bad events okay for example your sp said to you for example you text them and he said like i don't intro i don't want you i don't want to talk to you then revise this event that like he said like yeah i really want to talk to you and i really miss you i want to be with you if there is nothing in the past that affects you it means that the event never affects your present moment right now, right? So make the revision. Okay, the next one is of course mental diet. Mental diet is so important during this manifestation period. And do not change your mind for a second okay so, uh, you have to use a strict mental diet okay if you're just thinking opposite side of your manifestation just think the uh, just turn it uh, to a, a positive uh, thing for example if you're thinking that you're not valuable just say to yourself i'm valuable okay and everyone just give my value to me every i'm worthy for it okay i'm lovable i'm chosen whatever and just be that mental strict diet if you want to manifest your sp just insist on just persist on the idea that he is in love with you right now and there is nothing to change this okay so mental diet is also important by the way i'm gonna put the links that up here uh if you want to make a more uh, clear, a cl more clear explanation for all of them so you can click and watch the videos too and the next one is no one to change but only yourself uh, uh, if you're just uh, thinking like that you cannot change anybody by messaging them by talking to them by trying to convince them to something okay you only can change yourself when you change yourself you can change the uh you can see the change from outside okay so you should change the um change yourself inner self and you can see the reflection from the outside and do not try to change the reflection okay if you are just saying that if i don't text my sp he forgets me yeah most probably he forgets about you because this is your inner self but when you change your inner thought like i'm for i'm unforgettable no one can forget me so he is a human being so he cannot forget me also so i not worry about anything i'm lovable okay just change it like that when you change your inner self thoughts whatever you can see the all reflection from outside if you can't change yourself do not expect that outside can change without you because everything is within you okay so i think the last one is the living in the end living in the end uh it's a controversial issue because uh, it's a really difficult for uh feeling like you already have your things okay and but uh think like that living in the end it's something like when you are having something you don't need to want uh this thing anymore right you don't feel like there is a lack you don't feel like uh yeah i'm craving for it because i really want it and, or or if you want to manifest a relationship but you are already in a relationship right now you never say like i want a relationship with my sp right because you already have it so live in the end okay directly do not think what's gonna happen in the middle okay it's not your job okay your your only job is like thinking like you're already having it so you don't need to worry about anything okay so i hope this video will help you if you like it please hit the like button and see you in my next video bye bye